question. Can you explain what internet is? Yes, I love technology. Pretty amazing. Truly wonderful the mind of a child is. Hey guys, Mr. Ogden here. Today we're going to do our first blog post on your website. So step one is to watch this tutorial video and I'll show you exactly what to do. And then step two, you're going to answer the following questions on your blog page of your website. So first go to your blog page, log into your website. Once you log in and go to this page, just click edit site, then go to your blog. It should say right here, you don't have any blog posts yet. What you need to do is go to the right bottom right corner and click new post and you're going to title this post blog number one and you can go back to Google Classroom to double check so blog uh, blog post number one school reflection so you're going to write blog post number one school reflection this will help us keep track of what number of blog posts we're on. So just uh, make sure you go back and look at Google Classroom to tell you exactly what to, t to type. Once you do that, you're going to go to the left to your builder and you're going to take the text and drag it into this page down here. Now you can type. So now you need to answer the questions one through six. What are your grades like? What are your grades right now for each class? You can use Atlas if needed all the way down to six. For full credit, you must type 250 words or more. How do I check my word count? Well, let's say I'm typing on my blog. My grades right, right now are just okay. So as you start typing, you can click in the box. Once you type in the box, you can press Control A to select all your words and then Control C to copy. Then you go to the word counter, which is right here. You can also Google it, just type word counter. Click in the box and press Control V. I have seven words. You need 250 or more for full credit. One other way that you can select all the words is if you click in the box and then you click three times, one, two, three, it selects all the text as well. Now I can do Control C or I can right click and do copy. Same thing and then go to my word counter and then paste control V or you can right click and do paste either one seven words once you're done what you're going to do to turn it in is you're gonna take you're gonna click post so let's say I'm done <clears throat> even though I'm really not because I only had seven words I click post and now you see your blog post is right here you're gonna click up top in the link press control C and you're gonna go back to Google Classroom and open up the assignment which will be up here on the student accounts open up the assignment and turn in your link to your blog page so it'll just be this page this link right here go back to Google Classroom and turn in that link and it's due today let me know if you have any questions